What is that first thing that comes to your mind when you start planning an event? Well, you want it to be fun, entertaining, engaging, and exclusive. Today we are going to talk about a party on the water on a boat with a backdrop of beautiful, gorgeous San Francisco. And I have the event coordinator of Hornblower, Jana, with me. She's going to walk us through what is possible on these kind of events. So here at Hornblower, just about anything is possible. Anything you want to put on a boat, if you can think it up, we can generally do it. Um, we host any sort of events from weddings to parties um, to corporate events, any sort of event you can think of, we can hold on our boat uh, from San Francisco. So tell me what are some of the events that you've already hosted here and how did it go? Uh, we hosted every single type of event you can think of generally. Um, Corporate parties, holiday parties, weddings, and gates, engagement parties, bachelorettes, anything we've done here. Um, now, what do people like the most when they get out of the boat? What is it that sticks to them? What do they take away? I think one of the most unique things about having your party or event on a yacht is the fact that the views are nonstop. They, you have the Golden Gate, the city skyline, they're gorgeous and they're always changing. So it's definitely a unique perspective that you can't get anywhere else but out on the bay. Now with Hornblower, uh, what is it that you want to achieve by putting these events? What is your goal with events? What do you want to do? Our goal is always to make the event that our customers want to create. So whether that be their perfect wedding or the perfect celebration for a bridal shower or a bachelorette or a wedding shower, anything between. We like to create whatever our customers dream in their minds and put it on a boat so they have their perfect event. So the Bay Area landscape and the demographic is mm -hmm. changing. Uh, we have different ethnic groups now. Uh, how have you tweaked or kept up to um, different ethnicity to host events that suit them? Well, we're always looking to expand our list of vendors. We work with all sorts of vendors from all different groups and ethnicities, and we like to be very inclusive. So. Um, we try to work with and find the best vendors for all different types of um, offerings. We also have worked with different restaurants and caterers to bring in specific type of foods. If we're, say, not an expert in that type of food or if they have a preferred restaurant they like to work with, um, you know, while we do do most of our, all of our food in-house, we do like to work with other vendors as well to help with that if you have a specific food type you're trying to work with. <laughs> Now let's get more specific. Yes. Let's talk about Indian events. Indian and events, of course. Well, there's so many events that can be very elaborate and detailed, so that's one thing that's in common of many events. Um, so with Indian weddings in particular, we have very large venues, which we know that's always a struggle, is finding a venue large enough um, to host some of the Indian weddings. So one of our yachts, the San Francisco Bell, she's a beautiful paddle boat, um, and she holds up to close to 1,000 people and she has three beautiful decks, a huge sun deck, so we know we have event space large enough to hold large groups, or we also have event spaces we can have 50 people for more intimate groups. Um, so we're, we're really a one-stop shop, and we can help everyone figure out all those little details. Uh, you do have a showcase coming up, right? Is this the first time that you're organizing a showcase specifically uh, targeted towards Indian weddings? That's correct. We are having an event this March to introduce ourselves to your community. Um, we are having a South Asian wedding showcase. It'll be on Sunday, March 11th, dockside on our San Francisco Bell. So it'll be an opportunity for us to show um, our yachts and what we can do for you. You can see, you know, explore the boat. We'll have vendors there, everything from, you know, a fashion show. We'll have food and drink provided from some of our... Now, is this open to public? Yes, it's open for anyone who wants to attend. You just need to register. Um, we have a website at hornblower.com slash showcase. Um, now is it a fee for that? It is. It's a ten dollar fee, a okay. registration fee. Mm -hmm. You can also register at the door for fifteen dollars. Mm -hmm. But you do get free food, free drinks, you can see all the vendors, oh, see the boat. So good. it's definitely going to be a good time. Now, when it comes to San Francisco, the first thing that comes to my mind: weather, weather, weather. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's gorgeous today, and we <laughs> lucked out. Uh, but how do you take care of weather? I mean, I know you have indoor areas, mm -hmm. but how do you plan ahead uh, if it could rain, it could rain? Yeah, definitely. We always have, you know, inside setup. So we have indoor closed off climate controlled decks. So you'll always have a space to be, you know, protected whatever the weather is. Or if you want to go outside, we have beautiful deck space where you can enjoy, you know, the sun or the wind or whatever it is. You can enjoy the views outside.